We should look into military application. You can't. Mary would never have allowed it. Mary's not in charge here anymore. We have no idea what she's capable of. We don't know anything about her. She's like a real person. You learn and grow, just like humans do. Most delicious of all, the king of ice dreams, the Goliath. Oh, baby. So, what'll it be, doll? The Goliath it is. Actually, she's good, thanks. I am. Suit yourself. Sorry. If you know vanilla electronics don't mix, what about microwave ovens? Mm, she has a point. OK, there are exceptions. But there are many things that do not go together. Like... Last one, April. Exhibit A. I am programmed to learn through experience. If I cannot learn, then my protocols will not be fulfilled. Well, neither will mine if I don't eat this. If I do not fulfill my protocols, then I do not have a purpose. Nick said food could make you sick. Yeah, he did say that. The truth is, we just don't know what would happen if you ate ice cream. So how will I know if I like it or not? Mm. Mm. Uh, oh, brain freeze. Oh. Serves you right for eating so fast. Oh. Brain freeze? <laughs> Morning, Eve. Morning. Um, Eve, what are you doing? Simulating cranial crystallization. <laughs> what? I'm attempting to experience a brain freeze. Oh. <laughs> and is it working? Negative. Good. Because no one wants brain freeze. I do. Trust me. You don't. I'll never know what ice cream is like. And I'll never know what it's like to walk on the moon. There is presently an approximate probability of 13,200,056 and to 1 that you may become an astronaut. I, I rest my case. Better than zero. I know it sucks, and I wish there was something I could do. There is nothing. Actually, there is something. Come on. You are gonna love this. Oh, it's a classic. I do not understand the human desire to play video games. It does not fulfill my protocols. Well, we play video games to do cool stuff we can't do in real life, like uh, fly through space and race at warp speed and blast aliens. Make ice cream. So right, all you gotta do with this game is collect all the ice cream in the glasses. Simple. And the best thing of all, no washing up. And no brain freeze? Just try it. Now the uh, controllers are really, really tricky at the Or not. What a beautiful morning. Is it? Everyone's favourite maths teacher, Mr Bevan's back today. And that's a good thing? Yeah. He'll be setting his annual brain buster to the lunchtime math club. Whoever solves it will be crowned this year's official Green Park mathlete. Boring. Not to mention the £300 cash prize. <coughs> £300? <coughs> Easy there, eh? Uh, uh, uh. Nice. <coughs> Finally. How are you getting on with that, then? I have completed it 93 times. Ah. 94. K. This simulation fails to replicate the sensory reaction that I recorded when you consumed ice cream. 
It does not satisfy my protocols. Yeah, I sort of get where you're coming from there. Um, but maybe there's other things that can help you get a feel for ice cream. There's a whole load of um, science in ice cream production. This is some great stuff. I've got to go to school. Um, just have a read and uh, we'll see how you feel later. See ya. Don't forget your bag. Oh. <laughs> Marching in here and giving me orders like I'm one of your soldiers. I can't give you something that I don't have. I'm simply doing my job. I would like you to do yours and find that chip. I can't find something that I don't even find it is. My predecessor, Mary Douglas. If you understand this, passwords and codes, it's all hard tech and I can't just... That's enough, it. Dr. Cullen. Do your job. Find that chip. But chip! be held responsible for my predecessor's actions. I'll be calling tomorrow at 12. I expect results, Dr. Calvin. <sighs> Was there something? Uh, your meeting with, um... Confidential. Of course, of course. It's just I heard you mention Mary? It's on a need-to-know basis. And right now, you don't need to know. I'm home. Will? Is that you, Will? What are you doing? Manufacturing a frozen dessert. Yes, I can see that. Then why did you ask? We've been through this. You know not to play with food. If you ate this, it could... Could. What? It could or might or may harm me. There is inconclusive evidence that ice cream would harm me. And equally, it could cause a full system shutdown. You could die. Did you know about this? Know about what, Dad? Oh, what is this? What I think it is. Man, this tastes awesome. Dad, do you want to try? I warned you when you took Eve to that cafe. It's not like she's eating it, are you, Eve? No. Yeah, she's just making it. It stops. Now. But, Dad, it tastes so good. No buts. Just get this place cleared up. And, Eve, no more playing with ice cream. Do you understand me? Sorry, mate. <laughs> Brain busted. Abe! Abe! Will you get that? That boy is useless. Useless, huh? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Where is it? Is there anyone there? 
X becomes Y and save. <laughs> Come in, Will. Will, do you copy? Loud and clear, Dad. Great. Because I'm right behind you. Oh, this is useless. Why are you using obsolete technology? Everything in the lab is so hyper-advanced, believe it or not, the only way to go undetected is to go analogue. And, in theory, if I can get this bug working, it can bounce a transmission to another phone without detection. Why not use Evertab? Eve can pick up all sorts of frequencies. I'm pretty sure she can hack into the Calamo phones. Eve, show them what you can do. Eve's got mad skills. No, no! You're my little cupcake! Dad? And you're my pumpkin pie! <laughs> Mum? Is Eve transmitting live from your parents' telephone line? Is my cupcake hungry for a slice of hot pumpkin pie? Oh, gross. <laughs> so long as it doesn't spoil my pumpkin's appetite. No, no, turn it off. It's not funny. <laughs> Eve, this is brilliant. There's a call coming into the office at noon today. If you can hack into it for me, I can find out what Catherine is up to with the military. What do you say? Okay. Eve, do you read me? Patching into target. Connection established. You are online. This is as serious as it gets. General, I take theft from my lab very seriously. All respect, Dr. Calvin. This is bigger than your laboratory. I told you yesterday. Our missing technology is a matter of national security, so you can continue to point the finger at your predecessor, or you can take responsibility and find the stolen tech before, before we shut down Kalamov system. You have no right! You have no idea how dangerous this is. Just find it. And now, to announce this year's Green Park Mathlete. The Mathletics Champion is... I can't believe I'm about to say this. Abe Watson. What? Abe Watson. What? With Sister Lily in a close second, who came within the power of X of winning. Well done, Watson. Well done. There's your trophy. Shake my hand. Well right, that's enough. Let go. Let go. Right, uh, class dismissed, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I don't understand. Thank you very much. Thank you. You. Ah, uh, Mr. Bevan. When are we going to settle a certain financial matter? Please make all checks to Abe Watson Industries. Wait, that money's... What? Oh, nothing. Uh, I admire your confidence, Watson, but there's still the small matter of the final to consider. The final? This is the Interschool Mathletics Championship, Watson. Parkside Secondary are sending over their brightest brain as we speak. Here is the equation. You have one hour to solve it, and then we want to see your workings out. We're counting on you, Watson. But the money. I'll never be some Parkside boffin. Not unless... No way am I helping you. <sighs> Come on. I know you can crack this. All I have to do is copy out your method, then I take the cash prize. No. This is about the money, isn't it? Really, it's not about the money. It's always about money. 60-40, take it or If you really want my help, I'll do it for free. 
If it's not about the money, why help me? Because you're my little brother. Nah, I'm not buying it. <laughs> OK. Ice cream's on you for the rest of the month. Two weeks. Fine. <laughs> Deal. We've got work to do. Oh. <sighs> Where's Eve? Uh, I don't know. I've just come out from lunch. Why? What's happened? Uh, well... What am I, Nick? What am I? Eve, are you OK? You have no idea how dangerous this is. Just find it! All I know is that Mary was working with the military. On what? On me. That, that's inconclusive. We don't know anything right now. I need to talk to Will in, in private, please. I, I just don't believe all this. She was so against war. Maybe there's more to Mary than what we know. Hmm. And more to Eve. Until I can get to the bottom of whatever this connection with the military is, Eve goes nowhere and speaks to no one, all right? She's grounded. If Mary was building Eve for the military, do you think that she could be some sort of, you know, weapon? <laughs> Where is compatible? You'll have to guess the password. And make it fast. Your job depends on it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You've done so well, Watson. Winning this money for the maths department. <laughs> Wait, the what department? No, no, I won this money. Are you sure did? Could this get any worse? Smile. I know it sucks being grounded. It's only because he cares about you. And your family. Then why am I treated differently to everyone else? It's not like you're being treated different. It's because you... you are different. Because I was built by the military? Eve, we don't know that for sure. Mary always said, no. knowledge is power, I'm in. Drones. Remote control planes. You seem surprised. Surprised? I, I guess it's just still a shock that Mary was involved with the military. I, I didn't think she had it in her. Perhaps she doesn't. Looks like she took the military state-of-the-art quantum chip that was supposed to be in this drone, but failed to honour her side of the deal. So she wasn't working with the military. They're just looking for a chip. 
Not just any chip. A quantum chip. To blow your mind if you knew what it could do. And they're not looking for it. You are. Quantum chip. Wow. Let's see what it's capable of. Hey guys. So, who's up for celebrating Abe's victory with Goliath at GP Eats? Boom, yeah. Eh, no chance. You're paying, but staying here. You're not my mum. No, I'm much worse. I'm your big sister. <sighs> well? No, I'm staying with Eve. Go! Do what you like, because you can. You're not dangerous. Eh, uh, did I miss something? It's just... Go! Oh, this game stinks. Look at those graphics. I can't believe people thought this was realistic. I think this is like a form of torture. I just want to go outside, but I can't. Oh, being grounded is against my human rights. I should take this to Brussels. I can't wait till I grow up. No big sisters or fun-killing parents tell me what to do. Still. Is kind of addictive. Right. Okay, Dad. Thanks for letting me know. Is she okay? Yeah. Yeah, she is. Dad was wrong about her. Eve wasn't built for the military. Mary just used one of their super high tech microchips or something. So, Eve's not dangerous. No. Well, that's really good, right? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Nick Clark. You can't stop me doing what I want. Hey, Eve. Um, I'm in the middle of something important here, but we'll talk about this when I get home, OK? You think I'm dangerous? No, I don't. I got it wrong. I made a big mistake. Um, I'm sorry. Please, Eve. Eve, please. From now on, I do what I want, when I want. She has a point. You're not her father. You're her uncle. <laughs> yes, that's me. Just an uncle. <laughs> I like the sound of that girl. Strong, independent female. Just what your household needs. I just need to finish this level. Eve! Eve! Uh, what's going on? Where's Eve? Eve? I told you, I just need to finish this. Where is she? She's right here. Oh. That's why I was winning. Oh, no. What? What is it, Dad? The chip. Yeah, you said it'll be OK. No, no, it's, it's inside Eve. And? It's unstable. When exposed to very cold temperatures, it explodes. Explodes? Yes! OK, Eve, think. Did Eve say anything before she left? She might have said something about not wanting to be told what to do. And? Going to GP Eats for the real thing, whatever that means. Oh. the fire. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
It's all right. She's all right. Nothing happened. <laughs> Nothing happened. <laughs> My sensors registered this substance as most unpleasant. <laughs> I, um, I just wanted to say... Dad, you're blocking us. Sorry. Uh, I shouldn't have come down so hard on you. I was wrong, and I... Sometimes there is a good reason to stop someone from doing something. Like an allergy. Or blowing everything sky high. Well... When I tried the ice cream, it should have caused a reaction. It didn't. Why not? That quantum chip was already a miracle of science, but Mary took it a step further and regulated it to withstand extremes of temperature before she put it inside you. She was a step ahead of the military. She was a step ahead of science. It's truly mind-blowing. <clears throat> for, uh, for some. Why do I not behave as science predicts? Predictable's boring. I predict I will not be eating any more ice cream. I think that's a good idea. I promise I'm not mad at you for ignoring my explicit instructions not to take Eve to the party. Where is she? Don't panic. She can't have gone far. What was that for? <laughs> We've got it. Kalamov systems are tracking the chip in. We have to shut it down now. Eve!